infections causes symptoms and treatment. Ear infections are caused by bacteria and viruses. Many times, an ear infection begins after a cold or other respiratory infection. The bacteria or virus travel into the middle ear through the eustachian tube. There's one in each ear. This tube connects the middle ear to the back of the throat. How do you treat an inny ear infection? Inny ear infections often go away without treatment after a period of time. However, a doctor may prescribe medication to treat the symptoms of the infection. A person should contact a doctor as soon as symptoms of an inner ear infection appear. Ear infections in adults are typically caused by germs, such as viruses, a fungus, or bacteria. The way a person becomes infected will often determine the kind of infection they get. People with weakened immune systems or inflammation in the structures of the ear may be more prone to ear infections than others. How long do ear infections last? Middle ear infections often go away on their own within two or three days, even without any specific treatment. In some cases, an infection can last longer with fluid in the middle ear for six weeks or longer, even after antibiotic treatment. What are the symptoms of ear infections? Common symptoms of ear infections include mild pain or discomfort inside your ear, a persistent feeling of pressure inside your ear, plus like ear drainage. Hearing loss, these symptoms might persist or come and go. Symptoms may occur in one or both ears. Pain is usually more severe with a double ear infection, which is an infection in both ears. Chronic ear infection symptoms may be less noticeable than those of acute ear infections. Symptoms of an ear infection in children along with symptoms seen in adults such as ear pain and drainage. Young children and babies may show other signs of an ear infection, such as rubbing or pulling their ear feathern reacting to certain sounds frequently losing balance headache. Fussiness or restlessness loss of appetite usually, ear infections last fewer than three days, but they can persist for up to a week. Causes of eustachian tube blockage include Allergies, cold sinus infection, sexist, new car smoking changes in air pressure. Ear infections can also develop from infected adenoids. Your adenoids are glands on the roof of your mouth behind your nose that help protect your body from infections. Infections can spread from these glands to the nearby ends of your eustachian tubes. What is the best medicine for ear? Acetaminophen, ibuprofen, or naproxen can often relieve the pain of an earache. Ask your doctor which is right for you.